Hey, it's Random Pop Culture, Mr. KK, Mr. You know, we're you guys are asked for Torch's channel. Follow me on my social media hashtags and AOL hashtags in the down below. Second eight, official launch trailer, the last of the last freaking one. It was another one that had an extra bunch of crazy ass footage and commentary. I'm not gonna react to that. I'm just gonna wait till January 26th when the game comes out. <laughs> Will I get a chance to play on my PS4 Pro? I don't know. It'll be as what it is. I'm not gonna enter outro shit after this video, but it was in the end, Jones, and I still wanna do a react on that. I know it was like four, five, six days old, but it was like old drama about the chick that was from Visby, Zizzy Pop. I think she did something about um not her, but it was like a dude named Verbal Ace or Verbal Base. I heard about him a long time ago in 2017, 2018 as a beatboxer YouTube. He got in a crap ton of trauma and trouble. It was like he made a not safe for work R34, Gel Boru slash very, very not safe for work, unfriendly for YouTube, completely unfriendly for YouTube. I would have done a reaction to it, but I'm not doing a reaction to that. I'll do a separate video on that one. Three, two, one, let's get in for this one. Second eight, official launch trailers. That's it. No more after this. Unless there's more. I don't know. Let's jump in <laughs> That's cool. I like that. Hold on. I almost forgot my freaking old Nintendo monkey. All right, let's go. We must seek Jin Kazama. The battle to decide the ranks of the new world begins now. Now to do sit in English too. Sounding different from the other dude. Oh, I was born for this day. You look like Jane in the mix. I get a load of this. You impose a threat and I'm a After rocking the gold, I'm not a diamond. The fighters will battle for personal glory and the fate of their countries. I'll give Kazuya a nice smack in the face. Who was the dude that they hurt? Goes voice from Dragon Ball Z and Super. One was a different voice actor. Knew that's Paul Phoenix. It's so crazy. It's three days before my birthday it comes out. That's wild. Still wild. It's three days right after my birthing time on my place. I'm Freaking big three five and we smacked out my thirties a middle aged animal. <laughs> Anyways, lots of views and opinions and speculations. Not really much for it. It looks good. It looks amazing. It looks great. A lot of other people doing their reactions too. I see that there. <laughs> it's the one all I care about is mine. I'm not trying to sound like a pessimistic or showboating motherfucker or full of shit, full of garbage, but whatever. I'm trying to sound like a cocky arrogant mother effer or nihilistic or getting a big ego or nothing. But yeah. That's it. It's crazy. I mean, the only time I'm going to show is the summertime when they do DLC in like spring or summer when they do the Evo Tournament 2024, which is crazy because hot damn, this summer 2024, especially here in the United States, man. And there's going to be a shit ton of things popping all day, literally next month. You know, I really don't give a shit about basketball or football or baseball, American football either. The fucking NFL thing is going to be coming out of Vegas when freaking Usher is going to be performing, which is pretty wild. <laughs> I think he just released a trailer like three weeks ago about his trailer thing. And a lot of nostalgic people that grew up as a millennial, they probably remember exactly who Usher Raymond was. A ginormous ass hip hop R&B singer here in the United States, just in case you didn't know. He knew when I was like 19 years old, 1998, 1999, early 2000s. It was when I was really super popular, especially when I was in high school. Now. Almost every black, morena, Hispanic, Latino chick, they freaking gawked over that dude. They were probably simping over that dude back in the day. It's just insane as hell to believe. But that's how it was in early mid 2000s and late 90s. But anyways, getting off track. And then they got the fucking Olympus going on and the bullshit politics is going to be a thing. It's going to be a fuck ton of crazy ass shit that happens this year, 24. And there's probably going to be a bunch of crazy UFO, UAP, alien stuff that's going to be out. Who knows? This year, it's probably going to be way more interesting. Shout out to my boy, Jakey the Snake Tapper, a.k.a. Jacob um, Small Hat People, Jacob's Ladder. I'll leave the link to this video down below. He already talked a whole live stream about it. He's way more 
of a bigger expert at that stuff. He knows how to talk about like a lot of numerology stuff. And he knows a lot about this stuff. And sometimes he's a little bit of a meatball, a little bit of a comedic clown sometimes. I don't agree with all the shit he says, but sometimes I do. And then another dude like KJ and Richard, RFB. Those guys are way cool. You know, they got their flaws once in a while, but they're still cool as fuck. I'm about to Takan. Takan ain't. My God. This shit's gonna be popping the frick off, man. I can't wait to get my, my freaking three main female players I used to do. Alicia Bosnovich, Anna Williams, and then, of course, the other one. Oh, man. <laughs> I know she wasn't a main player. Um, Asuka. I think her name was Asuka Kazan. Or the other one, Lin Long. And then there's the other one, Asuzina. I'd never seen her before because this was last year when we first saw her in the first time. Spend Latino representation. I'm not talking about the whole Latinx bullshit. I'm not going to call it the Latinx shit. That's freaking retarded to me, honestly. But anyways, one other thing I'll say is this. This is looking really, really nice. It looks like the Kazuya because I was going to put another crazy championship there. They still got this dude for Secession, Brian Cox. I don't know if he's going to be the narrator for some of the freaking stuff. I still don't know how the hell they could all communicate in the languages, all different languages, but they have a deep understanding with each other. They know what they're saying. That's still insane that Tekken always did that shit. And I can't wait to see the extra lore and backstory origins. That's going to be popping off really, really good. My God, this shit's going to be off the chain, off the riz. Freaking on the top pop, hit slap, it's going to be lit. Whatever Gen Z or fucking kids are saying, I don't know. And on one other thing, oh man, that blue devil gene, he's probably going to be the devil gene. A devil gene, that's probably going to be crazy with his mom, Jun Kazama. I can't wait to see the more backstory versions for her and Itachi. That's going to be awesome. And then maybe they'll bring that freaking ogre dude back too. That'll be crazy. And that's it. Lisa Shubazambo, Cartana Sign of I know it's a little bit more shorter than normal because I really want to see that Indiana Jones thing I saw a few days ago. I didn't get to see it on Xbox Direct. It was like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday now. But that's it. I'm out of here. Peace out once again, ladies and gentlemen, and bros. And boys and girls, as always. Talk to you in the as always. We'll see you next week as a day, every night, wherever. Or in the world of the universe out there. Don't just smoke at the same time. So, they're reckless. Keep it calm, cool. Keep it keep it locked out there. Stay tuned for your conscious channel. Play. Video game industry news, video game console news, okay, just anime manga news, I rarely ever do. Um, VTuber, Hollow Live indie drama news, v virtual VTuber news, and of course, some celebrity gossip news, celebrity music cards news, especially reaction review segments like this one. And of course, some um, Twitch, YouTube, all the social media platform drama news, and uh, reaction review segments like this one, I said, and serious, strict, stern commentary reviews, I do once in a while as well. Peace out on Sauerkraut, thanks to my CEO on Flipside, take it easy, stay safe, I'm going out. Goodbye. Stay extra safe. Stay extra cautious. No matter. Stay safe. See you guys soon. Talk to you next future video. See you next time, guys.